at the very core of being a creator, it's about pushing boundaries and trying new things. UV tattoos actually contain fluorescence and in layman's terms, it just means that they're UV reactive. So when the atoms in the UV ink are exposed under a black light causing iridation, uh, they charge up and that's what emits the, the, the mad looking glow that's becoming so popular in tattoos. The application is very similar to a normal tattoo. I use both liner and shading needles to apply depending on the visual effect that I'm looking to achieve. The UV ink I use is typically thinner than regular tattoo ink, so I run my tattoo machine at a lower voltage and use slower hand movements to avoid damaging the skin. I also soften the hit of the machine. While applying the UV ink, it helps to have a black light on hand to see where I'm going, especially when I'm using invisible ink. The process of tattooing is, is very similar as to when an artist will use white ink. So I'll do the, the usual black and grey tattoo and then once that's completely finished, I'll put in the UV uh, at the end, just in the parts that really need it. The reason why I put in the UV at the end and the reason why realism artists will put in white ink at the end is because you don't want to muddy the ink with the black ink. So once the black ink's completely saturated into the skin, make sure the surface area uh, is, is clean and then the UV ink or the white ink goes in. Before I started using UV, I pretty much had as many questions as my clients have for me now. So I reached out directly to the brand that I was using and still use now and they assured me that they're 100% safe with all ingredients non-toxic and non-hazardous. UV is just like any other tattoo ink, so it will fade over time, but so does black ink. Uh, how much it fades depends on how well you look after the tattoo, uh, as well as skin type. As a rule of thumb, I'd say the brightness of the UV, uh, it probably fades between 20 and 25% once sealed. But I've got work that's over two years old now and, and it still looks great under, under a black light. Uh, I've spoken to other UV artists and done research. The general consensus is that UV lasts between six and eight years. It's still relatively new in the sense that not many artists use it. So it really is venturing into the unknown, which is a lot of fun because everything is new to me and I'm constantly trying new things. And honestly, probably the best thing about the job is, is the look on the client's face when they see the UV going in. It's a sheer shock and amazement. Obviously, it's something so new to them and, and it still gets me laughing now, to be honest with you.